Hey guys, welcome back to another Dollar Tree haul video. It's Wednesday, so that means I've got a video for you and this week's video is awesome. Best deals in a while for sure. Lots of new items, you're not gonna be disappointed, I guarantee. So let's go ahead and see what I got. Oh my goodness, so many cute finds at Dollar Tree this week. First, I'm gonna go ahead and start off with some of the fall decor stuff that I found at my store, cute, cute stuff. Um, I did see Halloween stuff up, and from what I saw, it was the same stuff from last year, nothing new yet. So I will keep looking. I still have stuff from last year, so if it's the same stuff, I'm probably not gonna be getting it, but I'm waiting for new finds. These are super cute. Check out these cute pumpkin. Um, little decor pieces. They are on a stand, so they will sit really good on a shelf, a table, anywhere you need to put them. This one says, Welcome Friends. It has the cute sunflower. It's got a little embellishment here. So I got this one. And then they also have this one that says, Hello Fall. So I just love these and I almost wish, I just got one of each. I almost wish I got two of each because these are really cute in like, on your bathroom vanity if you have a little corner space and you just want to put something festive but not over festive not too much stuff this is the perfect little decor piece so i was really excited with those and then i found a whole bunch of signs and the signs this year are really cute i hoping in a way i was hoping they weren't going to be because sometimes i over sign it and you know get too many signs but i did find the cute red truck um, sign with the big old pumpkin in the back. Now this is glitter. There's a couple different patterns and I believe I took pictures. So st uh, stay tuned to the end of the video and check out those pictures. But this is so cute. I had to get this one. And then there were some other signs. There's still more that I didn't even get, but I think I am pretty good with the signs that I did get. So this one says pumpkin kisses and harvest wishes. I love that. I wish they had one that said, like, you know, with the um, pumpkin, anything pumpkin, like the t-shirt, like you get at Target, anything pumpkin spice. I don't know how it goes, but that would be really cute. Um, but I love this. Of course, we have a little um, hanging rope here. So this would be cute on a door or anywhere really that you want to put it. And sometimes I use them in little corner spaces. Um, just for a little extra added decor. So I got that one. I got this one that says gather together. Check that out. Super, super cute. And then I also got this one that says thankful, grateful, and truly blessed. They're just so pretty and just so fall and autumn. It just makes me want to have like pumpkin coffee and all that good stuff. Now, some of these words are in glitter but really, really pretty. And I was happy to see the outdoor stakes, or at least I use them outdoor. If you guys have other ideas on how you use these, let me know, or how you decorate them within your house. You know what would actually be cute? And here they are, guys, before I get yapping. If you had like little buckets or something where you could make like a flower arrangement and have one of these sticking out, now it would have to be a pretty big arrangement, but I think like with the fall flowers that Dollar Tree has, that would be really, really pretty. But this one says, home sweet home. And they do, I don't think they had these last year, but they do have little hanging pieces here if you wanna hang them up. I love using these outside. These are really, really cute, especially if you have some pumpkins or usually we get a, um, a hay bushel and then we decorate it with different flowers and things and put our pumpkins on there and we have our scarecrow so it's really really fun and then this one says welcome to our patch now i just think that the designs are might be a little bit different from last year i don't remember but i remember there was one welcome to our patch now this one had a little bit of excess glue on it so if you notice that in store just look out for that so you know you can grab one that might look a little better but I'm fine with that because those are going outdoors okay crafters out there someone out there needs to make me a fall wreath I'm just kidding I did that again in the last video I'm just kidding but there are so many cute things to use for fall wreaths it really motivates me to want to make one um, so we'll see but I found these pumpkin clips I love 
that they came in white. So you can see here that they have the clips on there. You can use these for any kind of DIY projects that you may be doing fall wise. And if you guys haven't checked out last year, I did do a simple Dollar Tree um, fall DIY couple little crafts in a video. I will go ahead and link it in the cards above if you wanna go ahead and check it out. But they had the white, and then I also got them in the festive orange, and then they also had them in the red. So you get three per package, which is a good, good deal. These would make some amazing wreaths. And speaking of amazing wreaths, they have some really great decorative fall bows as well. Now I just picked up one pack and this one, you can see the burlap, but it has the leaves and the pattern, the orange leaves, very, very pretty. There were different patterns. I believe I have pictures at the end of the video, so stay tuned. These come two in a pack, but these are made so nice. The quality is so good on these. So these would work well with your fall projects. Okay, and I'm super excited about these metal words. Now, I've had this haul stuff for like over five days, so it's been killing me to share it with you, and I've seen a lot of people um, have hauled these too, so I know they're super excited. But these are a three pack of metal words. I am so thinking of a craft that I can do with these. Um, I got two packages. Uh, the words say, thankful, harvest, and welcome. The welcome, any of these would be amazing on a wreath, but like a front door wreath to have the welcome and all of the festive fall stuff, that would be so cute. So look for these. Um, pumpkins, I love pumpkins, and I was very excited to see these burlap pumpkins. Um, they came in different colors, but for some reason, I like to go with the beige. Um, it just seems to go really well. Um, but these are really, really cute. Something different. I don't believe that we've had these before. At least I've never seen them at my Dollar Trees. And then they had these burlap leaves. Now I wish that they had them in the red. So I got them in the, you know, burlap brown. And then they also had them in the green. And if you guys are crafters and you're wondering what you can use these for, they do have like a little stick part at the end that you can like wrap around whatever you're making to use them so keep that in mind five leaves come in a pack so lots of really fun crafting supplies i did get some fall flowers no rhyme or reason to these flowers guys um i always get sets of two two of the same so i'm thinking of doing a couple arrangements and i will keep you guys posted if i do and speaking of keeping you guys posted i did do my pantry makeover using some of the dollar tree products that i hauled last week so you can check out that video here or you can check it out at the end of this video i will post it so the first one that i got are these sunflowers i like these because they have the acorns in them and the brown kind of gives it a little bit of extra color so i got two of these i really like these mini mums in this red color and they do have a little you know pieces that are kind of like sticking out to give it a little bit more height so these were really cute i also picked up two of these these are cone flowers and kind of like the orangish yellow um, shade there. And then I picked up two of these mini, they're called mini flowers with grass. And they're kind of in the red burgundy color there. These are really amazing ones that I picked up. I don't even know what they are, Del delphinium. I hope I'm saying that right, let me show you guys. If you can see that, delphinium. I picked up two of these because these, they had them in different colors, but for some reason I'm gravitating toward this color. Um, these are so cute. I'm definitely looking for more of these. Um, these are so pretty for the fall. Okay, so do stay tuned because I have some really cute stuff to show. Cutesy stuff coming up next. But I wanted to announce the winner of the Smart Girl Nails. Now, if you've tried these guys, comment below and let others know how they work or how they don't work or what's good about them or how they compare to Sassy and Chic. Um, again, 
I am not going to be using the fake nails anymore just because my nails grow so quickly. It's just easy to keep, keep and maintain my own. These are super cute though, so it's kind of killing me. But the winner of the nails is Brenda Esparza. Congratulations, Brenda. Just be sure to email me. My email's in the description box below so I can get these out to you. And before I show any more of my haul, oh my goodness, this Dove beauty cream is amazing it is in the pink container i have not been able to find this look at almost done with it i love the scent of it i love the texture and the feel and it's non-greasy it is amazing the only one that i've seen is the blue one which i think is original but it's something about this scent that i absolutely love so if you guys have tried the blue one let me know what you think and if you've tried this one and the blue you know, obviously this one I love. I am so looking for more of these. All right, so who is ready for some cutesy items? Cause I am, when I saw these at the front at Dollar Tree. Now the items of the week were the little sequin baskets, um, which I've already hauled and they were out anyway. And they're supposed to have these little, they're supposed to be small because I asked the cashier. She said they sold out right away. These little sequin pillows. So I was hoping to get those for Sam, but maybe we'll get them next time. But we ended up getting these super cute keychains. Check those out. Oh my gosh. I absolutely love it. So we grabbed one. This is for Sam. Sam grabbed the pink. There are different colors. I think they're silver and gold, and I took pictures of those, so those will be at the end of the video. And then I grabbed this one for myself. Now these are perfect for back to school. The kids can put these on their lunch pails. They can put them on their book bags. I'm gonna put, put mine on like one of my totes that I have. Um, heck, I love them too. So these were just really fun. These are cute stocking stuffers or party favors if your kids are having um, a party. This would be something cute to pass out. Another thing that would be really cute for a party favor, I found one of the unicorn lip glosses. So this is a pink one. The pink one is apple scented. And this was also up front with the other items of the week. So I'm sure we have more different ones to go off of, but this was the only one that my store had. Stocking stuffer. Okay, and then I got these cute little notebooks, which I'm actually going to open up one because they have like these little stud pieces that put them together. I think they're just kind of like flip card books, but these are just little old cute notebooks. Check that out with the cactus. So I got this one. It doesn't say how many sheets or anything. I'm gonna open up one in a second. This one says stay tall with the flamingos. And there's actually little like diamond, um, little jewels on there. Really, really cute. And then this says no problema, no problema. Um, with the cute little llama on there. And again, there's the little jewels there. So this one I'm gonna go ahead and open. So we can see, it looks like it's almost like Yes, so it just kind of goes like this, a little, you know, flip book where you can keep, you know, these would be good for like flashcards even, but then again, you know, they're on a little sheet of paper, so you'd have to be careful because it's very easy to be ripped. Um, but these are so, so cute. Okay, and a couple more items to go ahead and share with you guys. Definitely comment your favorite item for my haul this week. I'm really excited about all the fall stuff that they have out. If you guys have seen something different, cute, amazing, share it below in the comments. Um, I found these super amazing Black Panther tote bags. I have not seen these anywhere again since I found them. And I've only been to one Dollar Tree, so I can't say like I can't find them anywhere. But I wish I bought more of these when I saw them. Um, I love the old comic um, design one here. This is my favorite. It just looks like an old comic book. And these are nice because it's like the Incredibles bag. I mean, these are pretty new, you know, as far as out in the theater. So it's kind of exciting when, when we can get items like that at the Dollar Tree. And then I grabbed this one as well. How cool is that? 
Any Black Panther fan would absolutely go crazy over these. So I'm really excited because I picked those up for my son and he's almost 11, so it's really hard to get him things at Dollar Tree. But you know, when he has like a school party or something and he needs to put treats and stuff in, he can pass them out in this really cool bag. So he'll be really excited. As y'all know, my daughter loves the wall stickers. She is constantly changing them out. Um, and I picked up some cute, cute new ones from uh, the Dollar Tree. So I picked up this one. It's the Main Street Wall Creations. It says love and peace. Really, really cute. Let me just bring up the picture there in the corner you can see. And then on the back, it has the peace sign and the heart and that says kiss you. So these are just really fun. And are they the best quality? Probably not. Are they the worst quality? Not at all. And for a dollar, she can change them out whenever she's getting bored. She can put something new up. This one is really cute. I think I'm going to put these inside my closet, like maybe even line them as a border in my closet because check this out. Not that I have a ton of shoes like this because I'm super tall and my husband is just a little bit shorter than me, so I can't really go with shoes like this, but that don't mean I don't love them. So there's just three super cute pairs here on this side, and then there's this pair, and it also says love my shoe. So I think I'm just going to border it around the bottom. It'll just kind of dress it up, be really cute. There are a couple of hearts. Here is where they have it here, kind of like on a shelf, but I think this would look really cute in a closet, especially if you have like a walk-in closet. I would probably buy a couple, maybe two or three, just to have a couple extra. Um, but yeah, I was really excited about those. Only two more items to go, but I thought my haul was just I was really happy with everything that I got. Um, so one thing that I found again, and this was a checkout, are the Pokemon pencils. So these are for my son as well. Super excited because I never really haul him a lot of stuff because he's very picky, but I know he'll enjoy these for fifth grade. Um, we did have a couple packages before and then we gave some as gifts away. So um, it'll be nice for him to have a fresh set of these pencils. And this is an amazing last buy for you guys. At least I thought it was, I was really excited. They have these expandable file folders at Dollar Tree, ha, huh, steal. So these have the little part here that you can open and it has, it is seven pockets. So there's seven different pockets. Does it come with the labels? Yes, it comes with a sheet of labels seven different pockets. It has a little string there to attach it. And then it also has a little envelope up here um, where you can keep little things. Um, sometimes if the, you're using this for budget purposes, these work really well. You can keep like a checkbook up here or stamps, different things that you might need. And then inside you can file different things for maybe, you know, your home or, you know, insurance, different things that you wanna keep track of or I like to buy these for my taxes. So every year when we get our taxes done, we give our accountant just like a whole bunch of stuff and then he gives us back a whole bunch of stuff. And it's nice to just keep it in these and then just label it, you know, 2018 taxes and we can just keep, you know, I think, I can't remember for taxes if it's five years that you need to keep or three years. We keep five years nonetheless. I think that's, an, I mean, I we've got more than five years. We've got like all of our taxes that we've probably ever filed. But um, these are just nice to keep them in here because sometimes we get them returned back in like an envelope thing. And if you start taking things apart or start looking at things, you might lose some of the copies or the W-2 copies. And then you have like a half, you know, set of taxes that were filed. So these are really good. And a lot of kids need these for school supplies. My son needed one with seven um, pockets. H however, I had to get him a five-star one because he's a little rough and tough on his school stuff. So I know that this one would not work for him, but maybe for the older kids, it would probably work a little bit better. Um, but hey, a dollar, grab these if you find them because these will go quick. So as always, thank you so much for watching another Dollar Tree Haul weekly video. Definitely don't forget to check out my pantry organization video. I'm pretty excited on how it turned out. 
I did use some stuff from Dollar Tree, Walmart, and Amazon. Not a ton of stuff because I did not want to spend a lot of money, um, but I think it came out pretty well and I'm pretty excited to share it with you guys. So until next Wednesday, good luck with your finds. Hope you guys are finding some really good things on your wish list. Thanks again for watching and have a great week.